Good afternoon. We daily vlog, so if you enjoyed the video, make sure you come back every day. We just got a very unsuspecting package. It's a Chicago deep dish pizza from Lou Malnati's, and we're gonna eat it this second. The air hurts. Thank you. Naughty. They are very naughty. <laughs> Tasteofchicago.com. The Windy City offers some of the finest food on the planet. It not only offers some of them, it does! Through our exclusive Taste of Chicago, Lou Malnati's is pleased to offer you the best and most authentic Chi Town favorites from Chicago style deep dish ribs. We gotta open it! We gotta open it! Oh. <laughs> we start confused with more Chicago favorites. Okay, look at this cool packaging. It's really awesome and they're incredible. There's a sausage, Lou Malnati's. Veggie, and then classic Garrett's. Um, we're gonna open this right now and see what kind of Garrett's mix it is, but it, there, this was also in the um, dry ice, so that's kind of weird that popcorn's frozen. But it's gotta be fresh. Yeah, it's gotta be fresh, so. Oh. And the Earhart's did it right. They got Chicago mix. Garrett, all forms of Garrett's popcorn is, is great, but the Chicago mix is the standalone best. We had that at our wedding. Yes, we did. So here's how the pizza looks before when it comes frozen. You got to take it out, lightly oil the pan, and then cook it at 425 for 45 minutes. Whoa, Black Betty. Bam, bam, whoa, Black. Oh, that looks good. I'm gonna break my camera. It's going all the way in. Oh, heaven. Oh, gosh. I think I just melted the microphone. Um, it needs like three more minutes. All right. First, uh, first look at the camera, it's fine. It's just got a little warm. I think the pizza's done. Oh. Ooh, la, la. Doesn't that look delicious? Looks done, right? Yeah. Sizzling. Look at that delicious pizza. They're, they are like thinner than you do when you get them at New Luminati's in Chicago, but it smells like a deep dish. Yeah, it smells right. Yes. Did you know there's a difference between stuffed pizza and deep dish pizza? Deep dish, would you say is like more sauce to cheese ratio? One's for scoundrels, one's for punks. <laughs> um, my family actually ate stuffed pizza more than deep dish pizza. And it's stuffed is more like cheesy. I mean, I guess it's kind of like in the word, like it's stuffed. And yeah, I think there's like more cheese to sauce for stuffed and then deep dish is more sauce to cheese. Or is it the layers? I don't know. Layers. It's like the where where the ingredients fall. And a stuffed has like like has a different crust. Like a thicker crust because it like holds more. Yeah, and sometimes there's even cheese like in the crust because it like curls up. Yeah. Yeah, you can also Google it if our explanation was not easy to follow. <laughs> I'm in heaven. Heaven. I was gonna say that Mickey Mouse song I had stuck in my head, but I lost it. <laughs> but heaven is a different song. I know. Oh, you don't remember it? I'm not gonna sing it because it'll get stuck in all of our heads. I'm gonna have a Pepsi with this pizza. Belly aches, we've got belly aches. We're fighting two different ways. Belly I feel great aches. now. I felt like I was gonna disintegrate <laughs> into a, a ball of uncomfortableness earlier because of the pizza we ate. I had more cheese before How did you? that. Oh, you did have more cheese before that. Because I have leftover <laughs> um, snacks from when Michael and Kim were here. They left us their, their leftovers. And I wasn't touching that, so... <sighs> anyway, do you want to vote for... Our next president? Wait this minute. Yeah. Oh my god. There's also a bunch of like should judges keep their jobs? I think no for most of them here in Florida. Should who wants to do soil and water conservation? There's like a young dude in one of the positions I'm gonna get. I'm gonna vote for. Um, there's a lot to vote for and a bunch of constitutional amendments. Oh my. You wanna be American citizen? Yeah, but I also want to go to Target. Well let's vote real quick and then um go to Target. All right, it's Friday. 
Work is done. We have a few errands to go run, but we're kind of on time crunch because we realize the first one closes at seven and it's six right now. But we're getting Eve set up. We're gonna head out the door. We got distracted because President Trump is going to the hospital. So we were like waiting to hear about updates on that. Um, but we gotta hit the road. Gotta go to the store. Fleet Feet Sports. I never know how to say this place. Altamont Springs? Altamont Springs. We're still not telling you why we're here. It has to, we'll tell you, it has to do with Sunday as well. Yeah. What we're doing Sunday. What we're doing we're Sunday. We're not telling you right now. What we need to prepare. Yeah. We had a rush enough. here because it closes. But I got the whole Martin suite right here. A little hint on the what I'm doing Sunday morning. All of this <laughs> is going to get used. In one day. In one event. Six gels, three caffeinated, three not. This is for the night before. This is for during, or right before. And then these are during. Can you tell where we're at from the signage? We are at Target. We were almost gonna get this, but then we didn't. Did we get, they don't have the right size for the, We've realized that we need to get stop getting the newborn stuff and start getting zero to three. Yeah. Because our little man might not be so little. And zero to three is like it could be a little bit big. Yeah. And you could just get more time out of it. Rather than like four days with a newborn outfit. Right, but these are cute. Those are cute. Oh, look, they have intelligence. I didn't realize they sold intelligentsia at Target outside of Chicago. Let me know if you've had intelligentsia. Because it is so good. Okay, so we're done with Target. We're actually going to drop off our ballots. To the right. right to the polling place. Um, did I miss it? Yeah. Oh gosh. We're right by the hospital that I'm gonna give birth at. That one, that big black building. So that is Winnie Palmer Hospital and then the hospital, Arnold Palmer Hospital, is what will be connected with James's pediatrician and so it's a little bit more specialized. So both of these hospitals, we will, like, that's, that's what we will use. Um, also, in Target, I think the fluorescent lighting freaked out my eyes um, because I started to lose vision in my left eye. So that means I'm probably gonna get a doozy of a headache, um, but we're just gonna go home after this and take it easy, and if it gets worse, I'll probably just go to bed. Orange County Elections Department. Supervisor of Elections. She's asleep. She's asleep. It is 11.15 p.m. I think it's a good time to go on a run. It's 12.30 in the morning. Just ran a solid six miles. I was supposed to run six yesterday, but I didn't, and I'm supposed to run two tomorrow in preparation for Sunday. Um, but I didn't run yesterday, so what are you gonna do? Can't change the past, right? Um, so that's why as the day kept going on and on, I, I overslept this morning and I didn't run because of work and blah, blah, excuses, 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 gotta get it done anyway. So that's why I decided that I was like, phooey, yeah, it's 11.30 at night. But I gotta run. It's about just getting out and getting on the feet, especially right now, because here in Central Florida at 11.30 at night, it is actually below 70 degrees. Not by much, by a degree or two, but that's like winter, it's like Christmas morning here in Orlando, so I had to take advantage of it. Anyway, I had to get back home, clean myself up, and get ready for our fun. We're doing parks both days this weekend. It's not even in addition to what we've got planned. Woo! She's so tired. But she's so cute. I'm just drinking a big glass of water before I go to bed. Sarah, actually, she was already in bed when I got home. Oh. But this little chicken was waiting on the couch for me. Ooh, it's a little late. Today is Friday, October 2nd. It's good to be home. What is this? Ooh, today's message is by Buddha. Each morning we are born again. What we do today matters most. Huh. I dig that. It is becoming ever aware in my mind that my son is going to be born very very soon and that's very exciting and I cannot wait. That's it. That's the rub of it. It's good to be home.
We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>